just like the song says, you've heard it all before. Early detection saves lives. But do you know the myths that stop people from getting screened and the truths that could save them? I'm Dr. Frederick Lee II, emotional intelligence practitioner, executive coach, consultant, and speaker. See, early detection for breast cancer is one of the most powerful tools we have in this fight. But too many times there are myths and misinformation that prevent people, especially women in vulnerable committee, especially women in vulnerable communities from getting the screenings they need. One myth is, I don't have a family history, so I don't need to worry. The truth, most women diagnosed with breast cancer do not have a family history. Family history increases risk, but absence of it doesn't mean you are immune. Another myth, I'm too young to worry about breast cancer. The truth is, while most cases occur in women over 50, aggressive subtypes like triple negative breast cancer are more likely to affect younger women, often before routine screenings even begin. That's why it's critical to know your body, perform self-exams, and speak up if something feels off. There's also the myth, mammograms always catch everything. The truth. Mammograms are essential, but they're not perfect. Dense breast tissue common in younger women and more prevalent among Black women can make detection harder. Sometimes additional imaging, ultrasound, MRI is going to be needed. In my research, women shared stories of delays in their diagnosis because symptoms were ignored, they were dismissed, or attributed to something else. Those delays cost these patients critical time while they had breast cancer, and that really matters. Because early detection doesn't just save lives, it improves the quality of the treatment options. It reduces the need for aggressive interventions, and it increases survival rates. So here's what the data tells us. When breast cancer is caught early, the five-year survival rate is 99%. But when diagnosed late, survival drops significantly. That gap is why awareness and education are so important. So let's replace myths with facts and fear with empowerment. Here's what you can do today. Number one, schedule your screening. If you're 40 or older, get your mammogram. If you're younger but at risk, talk to your doctor. Number two, you have to know your body. Do regular self-exams and don't ignore changes like lumps, swelling, or unusual pain. And number three, share the truth. Correct myths when you hear them, especially among family and friends who trust your voice. Right now in the comments, answer this question. What's one myth about breast cancer you've heard? Let's call them out and replace them with truth. I'm Dr. Frederick Lee II, and this has been your lesson in life.